1888. In a lab in West Orange, New Jersey, Thomas Edison is funding the creation of an electric killing device to replace hanging. It will be powered by AC generators secretly purchased from arch-rival George Westinghouse. Edison's hope? To forever link the AC brand with death and horror. The true history of the electric chair is incredibly creepy from a modern perspective. It was all about a battle between two different and competing electrical systems. Westinghouse's AC and Thomas Edison's DC. To distance himself from the project, Edison employs a self-taught electrician called Harold Brown. Brown wires the portable AC generators up to a series of electrodes to attach to the flesh, and a switch to start and stop the flow of electricity. Now he needs to know how much electricity is required to kill a living subject. One of the genuinely disturbing things about the electric chair is there was no real way to test it without testing it out on animals. He starts on dogs and works his way up to horses. The machine works, but Brown faces a problem clearly visible in this shocking footage shot by Edison's film company. A circus elephant called Topsy is publicly executed for trampling her trainer to death. Electrodes attached directly to the body deliver a 6,000 volt charge that cooks the flesh. For a lot of reasons, it didn't look good and it, it created a smell that uh, people found offensive. A series of human trials begins to see how the skin conducts electricity through resistance. Over 400 men are subjected to shocks. Low voltage tests show that upper layers of fatty tissue are a poor conductor. The current is cooking the point of entry. They must find a substance that can create a fluid barrier between the electrodes and the flesh. So Brown eventually came up with the idea that you would have a, a sponge soaked in brine and that that would help conduct the electricity. A natural sponge lets the current flow cleanly through outer tissue and into the body, preventing the skin from burning. In 1888, the U.S. Commission charged with choosing a new method of execution makes its decision. The Death Commission made a recommendation to use electricity. They felt that that was a clean execution, that it would be, uh, people would die immediately, that it wouldn't be bloody, that it was the perfect way of killing people. 